The following video demonstrates percutaneous partial mastectomy utilizing needle arthroscopy. This procedure can be performed utilizing local anesthetic with or without sedation. First, the standard arthroscopic portals are injected with the mix of quarter percent marcane plain and one percent lidocaine with epinephrine. Once cutaneous anesthesia has been performed, an injection of quarter percent marcane plain is then injected into the knee joint itself. This intraarticular injection provides further anesthetic for the patient's comfort. Needle scope, trocar, and cannula are then inserted into the medial compartment standard portal. It is suggested to utilize the portal on the medial or lateral side depending upon where the pathology was found preoperatively via imaging or diagnostic tests. The camera is then inserted and an intraarticular injection of normal saline is performed. Standard diagnostic arthroscopy is then performed. In this patient, a complex posterior horn medial meniscus tear was identified. During the diagnostic portion of the procedure, it is easier to utilize a syringe filled with saline than pump pressure as this allows for better visualization. The accessory medial portal is then injected with cutaneous anesthesia and cannula trocar placed. The saline syringe is then replaced with the pump and arthroscopic instruments inserted into the accessory portal. Needle instrumentation is then utilized to perform a partial medium mastectomy to a smooth and stable margin. Although the needle instrumentation is smaller, it still allows for efficient meniscectomy as it is quite sharp as it is a single use instrument. This also allows for easy evacuation of meniscal debris after meniscectomy as the fragments of the meniscus are a smaller size. An arthroscopic shaver is then utilized to clear meniscal debris and to further smooth the meniscal remnant. Any small diameter shaver can be utilized up to a size of 3.5 through the percutaneous portals that were created by the cannula trocar of the needle scope. Upon completion of the meniscectomy and the removal of meniscal fragments, the remaining saline within the intraarticular aspect of the joint is removed via the suction shaver device. Pressings are then placed and the patient is transferred to the recovery room.